motivation and the eating but doing the pick one has been very helpful and that's something that I'm doing with my boys and I have it on my refrigerator and even when sometimes I forget to bring my food to work I go okay I need my protein my carbohydrate and then my veggies and for the fat maybe a little bit of oil but I'm very conscious like what I need to do and what I need to eat and and also sharing that with my boys and and I see the benefits I share with Aileen that my hair I'm not losing that much hair and she said that's the stress <laughs> I mean no because doing the exercise and eating well it helped me my nails the good balance you know the food my nails are growing stronger before it's like weak and they will break with anything and then like knowing that I am physically strong more like a lack of support not having someone there to motivate me and I would start and then before starting that I would start doing something and then maybe something at work or my personal life might happen and then I will go back to ground zero and having like a going up and down up and down but um, my coach she is great and the classes so it's like I have say like an extended family you're laughing um, and supporting each other I think this time is I see the benefit how it's been helping me I also see why others are doing it as well that I can learn from them too like when I'm there I love the deadlift and like we have to do three sets of 10 so we started with 10 weights on each side and then I'm like let's do another 10 weights so we have 20 and 20 and then uh, I'm like you know I think she said from 1 to 10 and I'm like I will say sometimes negative 10 I'm like a 3 you know let's add more so it's like that challenge of okay you can do more and how to test how, how far I can go um, and this is new for me I really like it I, I am enjoying it that I, I can do it I am more confident, more sure of me. I see Marisa in the mirror and I'm like, I like what I see. My clothes are loose. I, I did take pictures at the beginning, but I decided I'm, I'm gonna stop it because I know myself. Because one day I told Aileen, like one day, like I was 190 pounds and then the next time I was 100 and, uh, 193. So what happened? And she told me maybe it's water retention and you know because I'm losing fat and gaining muscle so I'm like I have to tell my brain that so and now I'm like okay my measurement is my clothes so like being able to wear clothes that I couldn't wear before I bought a belt and I'm now like the second hole of the belt <laughs> so that is a measurement for me so I can track and wearing pants that I couldn't set before <laughs> Well, my kids and then my boss, she's very supportive. Like I say, I, I told her, I have to leave at four because I, like yesterday, I have the gym. And she goes, oh, yes. <laughs> and, and it's like, four oh, oh, one, Marisa, what are you doing here? <laughs> you know, and, and she's like a believer that, you know, we have to do exercise because if we do exercise, like we're more productive because we're happy, taking care of ourselves. And I see like, you know, he, 
be a supporter too. And then also with some of the teams that I work, they're like, I'm always smiling, happy. I more secure. I'll say in the past and um, before the program last year, I on my annual exam, you know, I had like high blood pressure, the sugar level, and then my heart. You know, the negative results. But now I'm like I'm taking care of myself, and I know I'm gonna live longer. I know that because it's it's like my spiritually, physically, and mentally health. This has helped me set who I want to be and remind me things that I used to do, like jumping rope. I used to jump rope when I was little, and I'm like, I haven't like take it up until I joined the gym. And I'm like, I enjoy doing this. And then yesterday, um, we did the dumbbell smashes, and it gave me a 15 pounds, and I switched it to a 10. <laughs> And she goes, no, 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 Marisa, you can do it. Because, oh, I did 95 pounds of the back squat, but I did it. I switched back to the 15 and did it. So, yeah. <laughs> to try it out, I wouldn't know how much I would enjoy it if I didn't try it out and not to be afraid. With Alan, I have a one-on-one. -on -one. And even if we have a group of five people, it's still a one-on-one. -on -one. You do what you feel comfortable doing. So it was amazing, Eileen. She is great. Well, all the coaches, they're all great. How the interaction with the students and making sure that we are doing it right. The encouragement, it's a good environment.